Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be fixing that problem that happens a lot. It's called attempt to end index nil with whatever and it's really annoying so I'm going to be showing you how to fix that. So we're going to start off by adding a part to workspace. I'm going to anchor it. I'm going to put in a proximity prompt and then real quick I'm going to go start a GUI, put in a screen GUI frame, move it to replicate the storage, and then put in a script. So we're going to say local player equals game dot players dot local dot local player. So script dot parent dot proximity prompt dot triggered connect function drop a line and then we're going to do game dot replicated storage dot screen gui clone dot parent equals player dot player gui player gui okay so we're gonna i'm gonna show you i'm not gonna explain what's wrong i'm just gonna test it and show you the problem okay so i have my output opened up i'm gonna press e tent to end index nil with player GUI, which is this script. So I'm going to stop and show you what the problem is. Okay, so what happened is we used what you need to do. So what I'm just going to explain what Roblox, what happened in Roblox. So we identified a player as a single one of these players. We didn't say who it was. So that means assigned to each individual but so when it gets triggered it connects the function and it puts the screen GUI into a local players GUI but it doesn't the system doesn't know who we're talking about so what we need to do gotta remove that and all we're gonna do player PLR whatever inside of these two parentheses and then we're gonna do game actually yeah game dot replicated storage dot screen GUI clone clone dot parent equals player dot player GUI and you can have this to whatever you want or whatever it is, you put it right there. So I'm gonna show you it now. Okay, so here we are. This is our thing. Okay, one thing I noticed wrong, I spelled player wrong. So I need to fix that, my bad. Okay, so here we are. Testing this out. So as you see, our GUI showed up nothing was wrong with it and also case closed this is how you fix attempt to end index nil so i hope this helped you solve your problem if this video is a bit outdated tell me and i will try and fix it again which hopefully won't happen anytime soon because that would suck so thanks for watching i hope you liked the video make sure to like and subscribe and uh, so yeah, make sure to like and subscribe. Bye.